assalamu alaikum this is mohammed ali nichum on fiverr if any client asks for a meeting link or if they want to discuss the project requirements through a meeting then it becomes a bit tricky in terms of fiverr because fiverr does not allow direct communication in that case you can follow this video here i will discuss with you some possible solutions that you can follow to do the meeting with client without uh, any hassle from fiverr in terms of link sharing uh, fiverr does not allow direct interactions uh, you can ask the client to provide you the link uh, that can be on the order page or in the inbox if client shares the links uh, then it's not a problem for you you will be safe if the client insist and ask you to provide the link then you can send the link through order page uh, if you have any running order with the client most of the cases the client do not have any running order and they want you to provide the link uh, through inbox in that case you can share in the inbox but it's not recommended because inbox will be a bit tricky and uh, it's not actually allowed for you to share any meeting link on inbox if there is no uh, running order uh, uh, through fiverr there is another way that is a consultation gig i am showing you how you can achieve that as you can see on the seller profile he has a gig uh, for consultation he will provide the consultation service through skype and zoom you can create a gig like that and put a minimal price on the gig uh, for example you can put five dollar for 30 minutes in that case uh, you will have running orders on your profile on your gig and if any client is really serious about uh, purchasing your services they can just purchase that gig and provide you the link through the gig requirements you can put a requirement on the gig asking for the meet link uh, so that the client can generate the link and send you the link on your uh, gig requirements here you can see the gig and though this seller is charging way too much for a consultation uh, for a consultation session but as you can see he is getting sales that means if any client wants uh, to purchase your gig and they are serious about working with you then they will not have any issue purchasing your consultation gig which you can uh, provide in the basic price like five dollar for 30 minutes in the 30 minute consultation session you can discuss the project requirements and the budget and if you agree with the budget then you can start the project on through fiverr as you have a running order with the client and you are doing the meeting uh, that won't affect your gig or that won't affect your profile uh, in any case it's better to keep a consultation gig so you can send the gig link through clients inbox or order page and ask them to book a consultation session with you so these were the possible ways you can follow to share links with clients and if you are sharing any meeting link uh, try to shorten the link through rebrandly or any link shortener services so that after the meeting you can change the source link of the meeting uh, by just logging into that platform apart from that these were all the possible ways that you can follow to be safe on fiverr when you are sharing any meeting link for project discussions the client you are finding through fiverr try to keep them through fiverr and take orders through fiverr don't communicate with them directly outside of fiverr so that's all on this video i'll see you on the next one i love this